Good morning everyone! Welcome back to Stardew Valley! It's episode 50! <laughs> um, okay, great. We're ready to start. <laughs> if I'm not getting stuck on the bed. Okay, weather report? Storm is approaching. Oh well. Ta-da! I have installed a few no new mods in order to pep things up. So, let's see. I thought you might like this. Yes, fire quartz! And, whoops, <laughs> didn't mean to step the air. And, as a special uh, gift for the 50th episode, a chocolate cake. <laughs> And for some reason, some of the... Huh. Some of my, of the... Machines? Of the mod machines turned into chests. But not everything. My mining uh, chest still remained a lemonade maker. But the other two machines turned into chests. Empty chests. Oh well. <laughs> Two free chests. Didn't I already empty the mail? Dear Psy, I hope you are doing well. Your grandpa would have wanted me to give you this old harp. Maybe you can play for him from time to time. I didn't get to play it much since you left. Love, Dad. P.S. I wrote the notes to your favorite birthday tune on the back. Aw, thanks Dad. The Harp of Yoba. Add sheet music to play and the birthday sonata. Popular on birthdays. <laughs> and I know a birthday boy who's going to get this song today. The dwarf. <laughs> Great. Um, the Harp of Yoba is another mod I installed. It's uh, essentially some kind of um, Ocarina of Time harp reference. <laughs> oh yeah, there's my stuff. Um yeah, I thought it would be kind of funny to have a harp. So, yeah, we're going to test it out with the uh, dwarf, see how, how well it works. Okay, and I'm going to move the chocolate cake, I'm going to eat it in front of the dwarf as he, if he doesn't want the cake. <laughs> uh, no. That's the order. Okay. Good. But before we do that, I need to attend to my fields. I'm kind of happy that two of these machines turned into... Well, chests. I guess that's better. So, um, where am I getting stuck? Ah. Some of the harvest is done. Whoop. Grape, spice berry, coffee, pl coffee blend, and blueberries. Lots and lots of blueberries. <laughs> I also installed a few other mods I'm going to show to, to you today. Just because I thought they were kind of sweet and nice. <laughs> yeah. And I just hope they all work. <laughs> and... Whoop. Okay. The Harp of Yoba has quite a few of those music sheets and I'm going to receive them over time by fulfilling a few uh, special requirements, as far as I understood it. Ah, you can 
store a chest inside a chest. This is good. It would be interesting to store a chest in a chest in a chest, turning it into a matroshka. <laughs> or not. Would be, would be quite the hassle to get everything out of it again. So, let's see. Um... Oh, yeah, right, I stocked the blueberries inside. Whoop. That globe is still here. Don't know why, though. We have gold, we have iron. And we have our fridge. Right. I guess I'm going to increase it to 70 and the rest will be sold. And I don't think I need anything else. Okay. <laughs> I can wait to try this out. Okay. In you go. Not going to sell you. I want to eat the chocolate cake as a celebration for the 50th episode. <laughs> ah, I'm just happy. Whoops. Okay. Um, garbage. 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 Not going to refill these two. I'm going to place them in the ocean. The important thing with the crab pots is that it's important to know where you place them, since they're obviously going to catch uh, different kinds of fish in different uh, bodies of water. <laughs> so I thought maybe I'm done with all the uh, crayfish and snails, and I wanted to try out a, a different fishing spot for them. Oh yeah, periwinkle. More snails! And... No important fish. So it's sashimi. Okay. I'm running around with pine tar. Do I need that? I have three of those. I don't think I need them. Okay. In you go. Alright. So. I guess I'm going to make a different rod. <laughs> ah, I love the house. It looks definitely nice. Hey, slobber. Ah, already pet you. Great. Getting stuck on trees again. Okay. Hey, Demetrius! Hey, Linus! How are you doing today? During all these years, I've discovered a few secrets about life. You'll have to find out for yourself, though. <laughs> he's, a man, uh, he's a wise man, and he's wise enough not to share the secrets. Alright. Hello, dwarf! I've got an, a harp from my uh, dad, which belonged to my grandpa, so I thought I'd play a little game of music for you. He loves it. <laughs> hey there. Huh. Zero hearts. I guess I can't really do anything for him. As long as I don't speak his language. <laughs> oh well. At least he got a little song. And we have some cooldown here. <laughs> Oh, that's nice. Hey, Ab Abigail! Wait up! My pet guinea pig David just hates this hot weather. He's fuzzy. You have a guinea pig? Wait. Wrong house. <laughs> I'm going to check out her guinea pig when, when she's not at home. 
But before we do that, let's get this blood quartz, red quartz. How oh, is it called? Fire quartz. <laughs> Almost. In here. Okay. Geologist, fire quartz. Bumble complete! Oh, Omni Geodes. Great. Oh my gosh. They're all around us! <laughs> we are the Junimos, keepers of the forest. We are bouncy and cute and look like apples. Ooh. They fixed the uh, boiler room. He sa he's saying something. Is this a follow me? He's so excited! <laughs> Why are you running, little guy? You don't have a package. <gasps> golden star. We have earned ourselves a golden star. <laughs> This turned Super Mario. You have unlocked the golden star. Oh my gosh, he's following me. <laughs> the gray little one is so happy. Hey there, little guy. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> this is worthy of a chocolate cake. Chocolate cake! <laughs> I want to eat it. Uh, I wanted to eat it while he's in front of me, so let's see, can I? Nope, I can't. It's like I'm trying to interact with him. Hmm, 50th episode! Woo! <laughs> oh, the music got so joyful as well. Hey, little one. Aw, he's bouncing behind me, I like that. <laughs> Bye! Till next time, little one! <laughs> we have completed one room! Woohoo! <laughs> uh, super cucumber. I think I already got one in stock. I'm not sure. Oh, ah, yeah, right. The crab pots. Hey, Moro. I didn't talk to you at your mom's house. Hmm, what sort of gadget should I tinker with this summer? Your decision. Oh my god, there are a lot of people. I don't want to give her a sweet pea. Maybe she doesn't like them. <laughs> okay, down to the beach. Woohoo! <laughs> One room is done, and it looks nice. Oh, are you looking for Aunt Marnie? Nah, not really. Whoop. Okay. Since Leah keeps standing down here, I'm not going to place the crab pots there, or she might block the way. Okay, and crab pot in here, crab pot in here. Don't forget to bait, or they won't catch anything. And. Yes. Hey there. I want to be just like my big brother when I grow up. That's okay. Don't mind me going swimming. <laughs> and another mod. Yes, you can. You can install a mod where you can go swimming. In the ocean, in the lake, in the littlest pond. And the best, best thing is... It's treating the swimming just as if you were up in the uh, spring, in the bath. So, if you rest, you're going to replenish your energy as well. Of course, there are a few uh, invisible walls that will keep you from moving too far. I think I can't leave the map. Uh, let's see. Looks like pretty far outside the map. 
It's taking me a while to swim back as well. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm nude. Can I... Can I go on the dock? Um, yep, I can. Can I swim in here? Nope. It's too shallow. <laughs> but I can swim right here. Of course, it does a bit of clipping, apparently. But I, and it's locked. <laughs> but I think it's great that you can that you turned into a swimmer. Hey, Elliot. A gentle little sunbeam woke me up this morning. I've never felt so refreshed. I was swam in the sea in the ocean. I'm feeling refreshed as well. All right. Need a drink? Well. Hey there. Oh, see, let me tell you of my travels around the world during summer. Some places it was beautiful, inspiring. In other places it was unbearable, humid and depressing. But you make do. See you around, see. The door is always open for you. Yep, that's also a mod. Gus is now far more talk active. It's one of the uh, dialogue overhauls. And I thought maybe Gus would need one just to fresh things up a little bit. <laughs> because he's he's a bartender. People usually tell a lot of stories near him or to him. And I think that just saying hello and everything is just a bit boring. So I, I used this great mod. <laughs> and I don't know the dialogues myself. I just know that they are seasonal. And um, yeah, they change with the heart uh, rate you have with him, how much he likes you, and he has an, a lot of new dialogue. I guess over 127 new dialogues around that. <laughs> Let's go swimming again. Yep. Um, okay, there is an invisible wall. I can't swim over here. I'm not sure. I'm not sure why I think it has... Okay, <laughs> I can't pass into the next area by swimming. Probably because the game doesn't know that it is possible, so it's not allowing you to do that. <laughs> well, yeah, I guess some of these uh, small tiles in the water are serving as invisible uh, walls, like the sea roses and the stones. So, yeah. You can move around in there, or as freely as you'd like to. But swimming alone is uh, quite fun. Swimming around. Invisible. Okay, I can swim here. Maybe if I enter from a different direction. Yep. <laughs> I have my personal lake I can swim inside. So, and again, invisible walls. Give a little checks. I forgot to pet you, didn't I? I got too excited. <laughs> Night, my little McNuggets. Oh well, it happens. <laughs> and more light. Okay. Soon that entire fields will be uh, glowing. Okay, one here and one here. Nice. I really have to install a pathway so the grass will, won't keep overgrowing it again and again. Ah, 
But it's already so late. I guess that's going to wait for tomorrow. Oh yeah, right, the battery packs. They are done. And they're going to be refreshed tomorrow with the storm. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, I know it's getting late. Hmm. Yeah. Fine quartz, sweet pea, clam. I have to crack these geodes. And I think I'm going to stock the batteries in here. Nice. Alright. Hmm. What do I do with these two chests? Hmm. I don't know. Just play some. <laughs> All right. And going to sleep. <gasps> they are fixing the mine cards. They appear quite big in the scene. Hmm. Wow, 5,000 gold. Nice. Yep, a lot of blueberries. <laughs> Alright, that's it for today, guys. I hope you liked it. Great thank you for sticking with me uh, through ep all this time and making it to episode 50. <laughs> Tell me what you think about the series, how you like it, how I can improve it, anything... Uh, that comes to your mind, or if you want me to see me try something else. I hope I'm going to see you next time. <laughs> I wish you a great day, and thanks a lot once again for making it with me to episode 50. <laughs> Alright, see you next time. Bye!